Hi, today I'm going to show you how we can create a topographic map with the hill shape. So the very first thing I want to do here, I uh, uploaded the US uh, topographic map. You can use whatever you have. So the very first thing I want you to do is that just come here, click on the properties um, and the symbology and then come here and click on the hill shape. So this is not the hill shape we are going to use for the final uh, result, but here we can play with these numbers and get what number we actually want to use. After we are happy with those numbers, we actually create a, uh, a hill shade layer. So here the only thing I'm going to play with is the Z factor and you probably need to use a very small number. For example, here point, um, 0, 0003. And assume you play with all these numbers and you click on that and say, yes, that's what I want. After you did that, I want to go into the raster, into analysis, and then we're actually going to click on the hill shade and create the hill shade layer. So here, use whatever number we created from the previous step. So the only one we changed it here was this one. And just run it, and it will create a new hill shade layer. After we did that, uh, the next thing is that I want to uh, put my original layer on the top. So this is my original layer. Then again, click on the properties and this time click on come here and click on the symbology and click on the single band pseudo color. Then you can come here on the roadmap. You can click any of those uh, uh, available default color ramp. But what I want you to do is just click on the create new color ramp. Then go down here in this one and click OK. And then move down until you get to the topography. And you have all these. You can use any of them. Today I'm just going to use this one just to show how it works. I click OK. You see it only shows you two of them. So one thing you can either cl click on that to see if it works on the classify and see it clear. It creates all the color RAM and then click OK or Apply. So, so this is our map with the, uh, the color ramp or color map that we want. The next thing that I want, I want to show the hill shade. So I will go again, uh, click on the properties, and then this time click on the transparency and reduce the transparency. You have to play with that. But for example, let me try 60 to see what happened. And then you click on that and then you will see this hill shade beneath this layer that you have. So now you have the color map and the hill shade and you can create basically topographic map with the hill shade effect.